Okay, in this problem, we're asked to calculate the work done on a moving or er, moving a particle along the x-axis, subject to a force f of x as x moves from x equals one meters to x equals pi meters, and our force is given by the equation four times sine of two x plus the natural log of x. So we want to find the work done on the force, and it's a continuous force uh, acting on the particle as it's moving from 1 to pi. So we know that the work is the integral uh, from 1 to pi of f dx, where f is our force function. So we have The integral from 1 to pi of 4 sine of 2x plus the natural log of x dx. So we know that the integral of the sum of two functions is the sum of the integrals. So we can write this as The integral from 1 to pi of 4 sine of 2x dx plus the integral from 1 to pi of the natural log of x dx. So we can calculate the integral of 4 sine of 2x using u substitution, which I'll go into more depth in a minute. And we can calculate the integral of natural log of x using integration by parts, which I'll also go through in a minute. But first we'll just calculate the integral. So we have So we get negative 2 cosine 2x plus x natural log of x minus x, evaluated from 1 to pi. So we can evaluate this. And we get negative 2 cosine of 2 pi, where cosine of 2 pi is 1, plus pi natural log of pi minus pi, all minus the quantity negative 2 cosine of 2, plus the natural log of 1 minus 1. Natural log of 1 is 0. So we can simplify this, and we get negative 2 minus a negative 1, so plus 1, so we get minus 1 as our constant term, and then plus pi times the natural log of pi minus 1 quantity, and then minus a negative 2 cosine 2 is positive 2 cosine 2, so we get that our integral is equal to negative 1 plus pi times the natural log of pi minus 1 times the quantity natural log of pi minus 1 plus 2 times the cosine of 2 pi, which is about Uh, one, negative 1 
0.378 newtons, meter, newton meters. And so that's the work done on the particle as it moves along the x-axis from 1 to pi. So now I kind of skimmed over the u substitution in the integral by parts. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. So we have the integral of 4 sine of 2x dx. And we'll let u be 2x. Then du is 2 dx. So we can substitute our u in for 2x. So we have sine of u. Substitute du. So we divide this 4 by 2 and take the dx out. So we get du and 2. We'll write this on the outside because it's a constant. So we have 2 times the integral of sine of u, du. We know the integral of sine of u is negative cosine. So we have negative 2 times cosine of u plus c. But since we're evaluating it from 1 to pi, plug in 1 for x, we get u is from 2 pi for x, we get 2 pi. So we're evaluating it from 2 to 2 pi. Or we can substitute back in for the u. So u is 2x, so we have negative 2 cosine 2x. Evaluated from 1 to pi. And that's the same as what we found earlier. And now we want to find the integral from 1 to pi of the natural log of x. which we will do by sub, uh, integration by parts. So we let u, we let u be the natural log of x. And v is just 1. It's hidden there. So we have 1, or dv, sorry. dv is 1 dx. Du then is 1 over x, and v, or du is 1 over x dx, and v is x as we integrate this 1 and differentiate in natural log of x. So using integration by parts, we get x times the natural log of x. Evaluated from 1 to pi minus the integral of 1 over x dx times x, which is 1 dx. We can take this integral easily. So we get x ln of x minus the integral of 1, which is x, minus x. Evaluated from 1 to pi, which is the same as what we said earlier. So we see that we have our u substitution produces the right integral, and our integration by parts also produces the integral that we saw earlier.